Hello guys, in this video we are going to see how we can create Microsoft Student Azure portal for free. So this process is going to be very easy and I will be explaining each and every step in this process and you have to follow each and every step as uh, exactly as I do because uh, if you do in it, uh, if you do anything wrong in the steps, you may not able to create your Azure RDP portal. By creating this Azure portal, uh, you will be getting $100 credits for free. So you can use that $100 credits to create free RDP from Azure and you will be getting many uh, learning resources also. So let's uh, open my browser and this is my Instagram ID or you can follow me and you can message me if you have any query or doubts and this is my Telegram ID. Here I post uh, latest information and uh, latest posts about my videos and channel and if you have any doubt any query then you can easily message me in Instagram so now let me open my browser and here you can see uh, this is my email ID and this is my edu email ID which I am going to use and if you don't know how to create this edu mail id then please do watch the video in the description and i button and in that video i have described or i have explained how you can create this edu email for free so please do watch it the link will be in the description and after this after you have these two emails and one more thing i want to show you is that my browser history so you can see my browser history is totally clean only I have logged in to this email that is this history and nothing uh, nothing is there in history so you must clean your browser history here and one more thing is that I am not using any VPN over here you can see I am doing this process without VPN and I recommend you to do this process without VPN and this is the emails uh, which I have and I am going to create my Azure account in this browser because previously I have faced some errors while doing in this browser I am completely skipping that video uh, which I have recorded and I am going to show you from beginning and uh, in this uh, browser I will do the next process so the whole process will be done here in this browser uh, because I was facing some errors in this browser so I am going to uh, do all the process in this browser so let me open the browser and you can check here I am not using any VPN and my browser history is also clean you can see so my browser history is also clean and I am not using any VPN over here please make sure that you are following the same thing and this is my edu email which I am going to use and this is my uh, Microsoft account or a, a Gmail account which I will be using for this process so now let's just search for this uh, azure for students like this you have to search so you can see you can see this link you will get hundred dollar of credits and uh, uh, it's for 12 months and no need of any credit card over here you can see now just click here this link and here you have uh, you can see you will get $100 of Azure credit and also no credit card is required. Now just click here start free. Uh, here you can create one account and this is the preferred method but I have already created account uh, while doing the process so I will just log in with the account and uh, you you have to just create one account and use your this not not gmail edu use your normal gmail to uh, create account but I have already created one so I'm just signing in so if you create one it will be good for you so I'm going to enter the password just click yes
so after signing in you will be seeing this page so you can see my account over here uh, after signing in you can see this page now we have to fill all these details and we are good to go so our first name and last name are there country let it be united states because uh, this edu belongs to the united states organization so let so let the country be united states now enter the school name uh, you can see the school name over here and if you don't know how to create this edu email then please do watch the video in the description and i button where i have explained how you can create that edu email for free so with that edu email you can also get a uh, google drive unlimited space so now just enter your school name over here and just scroll down so you can see this is the school name so i have given the school name now enter your date of birth so after entering the date of birth uh, just enter the school email address uh, this is our school email address so just copy this and paste it over here so after entering the school email address verification code is optional now just solve this uh, captcha so we have successfully solved our captcha and do check all these details if you have filled so after filling all these details now just click verify academic status so it's going to take some time So you can see a verification email has been sent to the school email you provided so just check our school email so you can see here we have received our uh, mail uh, for verifying our azure so what we will do now just copy this email at uh, copy this link copy this to whole link and not uh, don't paste it here uh, just copy this link and paste it in the same browser where we have started our azure method process so just paste it and click enter So it's going to take some time for verification. Now let's click here start puzzle. and just solve this puzzle after that just click here verify so after this uh, you can see here our academic status has been successfully verified now just click here continue and now just close this tab and again create new tab and again search for same thing azure for students again visit this link same link and again click here start free so you can see here it is confirming our account so let's fill all these details let country be the same as uh, you are in the country don't change this and 
enter your phone number here just scroll down and you can see first name last name email address phone number and organization every details over here just fill these details uh, you have to give your phone number uh, you just give your own phone number so after giving the phone number just give the organization and after this you have to enter the address uh, just give your own address don't uh, give any fake address over here Uh, check this box uh, you don't need to select this box now just check this box and click sign up again I am repeating I have given my own address uh, you can give your own address don't give any fake address over here so it is loading it will say take some time and let's see whether we are able to create our Azure portal or not. So it is confirming our information. So you here you can see it is setting up our account. We have successfully created our Azure portal for free. So you can just check this and submit this feedback. Uh, it is redirecting to our Azure portal so guys here you can see uh, total credits are 100 out of 100 and the days are 366 days so we get one year of credits for free so we have successfully created our Azure portal here and you can also create your Azure RDP from here and if you don't know how to create Azure RDP then I have uh, uh, I have a video in my channel and I will be giving that video link in the description so you can create uh, RDP for free after creating this Azure account so do watch that video to create Azure RDP for free after creating this account so you, you can successfully see over here we have successfully created our uh, Azure RDP, Azure Portal, Microsoft Azure Student Portal for free. So let's see subscriptions. So here you can see our subscription is Azure for Students and it is status is active currently. So this is the uh, process and you can also create your Azure RDP for free. and. Uh, you have so we have successfully created our Microsoft Azure student portal so in this way we have we can easily create our Azure student portal for free so here you can see we have received our mail regarding uh, the creation of our account so this is the whole process how you can create Microsoft Azure uh, student account portal and this is the way you can get hundred dollar of credits for free and uh, if you have a doubt that how for how many days it will work it totally depends on your usage and how you use this RDP maximum it lasts for uh, one week or uh, it may last for many days also if you use it correctly so this is the whole process so we'll see you in the next video thank you